you big changes could be coming soon to Beloit as the minor league Beloit Snappers baseball team has announced plans to build a new downtown stadium. City leaders of Beloit say it's just the latest in a large-scale economic development. Adam Duxter spoke with leaders today about how a new stadium would continue that growth. Adam? Well, Eric and Charlotte, a new stadium for the Snappers is something that leaders in the city of Beloit have been pushing for for years now. And now that it's closer than it's ever been before, they say so is a new look downtown. A look down East Grand Ave in Beloit is all it takes to see what's new. We've gotten several new restaurants. We got a new boutique hotel. Um, we have a new brew pub that's coming downtown in the next few months. Shauna El Amin says that's a result of the city building around one of its biggest assets. The city's been thinking about the riverfront projects um, for years now. The river is really our hugest asset of the downtown. It's beautiful, it's accessible, it's easy for everybody to use. Thursday, the executive director of the Greater Beloit Association says she got even more good news. Home plate facing the river. As the Beloit Snappers minor league baseball team announced it was being sold, with the new owner planning to build a stadium in this field right next to the Rock River in City Hall. The downtown move, something on the minds of city leaders for years. Bringing it downtown is going to bring more visitors to our downtown area um, and it will spur additional economic growth. You know, the more our downtown thrives, the more the surrounding areas will continue to thrive. But it's not just a stadium, but also a riverfront apartment development and riverfront mixed use development for Beloit College that have people in Beloit looking forward to the future. You know, we've been working on these things for years, and it's just so exciting to see some of these things, the, the baseball and the apartments, all of it is just huge for the downtown area. Most of all, they say as every new project is announced, developed, and finished, it helps change the way others see the city on the state line. It's hard to know what is like down here until you've actually been down here. Now, there still are a couple of things that will have to happen before the Snappers' new stadium will become a reality. One of those things is to pass through Beloit City Council. Another is to go through several community listening sessions, the first of which is coming up on Monday at the Beloit Public Library. But should everything go according to plan for city leaders, they say construction could start as early as this upcoming spring. Adam, thank you. We're learning